Thank you. My name is Mark Rogers. I'm Ben and I reside one way south Cross Street on the south side. I'm a proud parent and concerned citizen, scholastic coach, and the lead activity provider with the BGC's Summer River Swim and Water Hall Camp. They're just going to college, and I think it'd be a great addition to the swim team. And of course, she's going to get a studies award and, and all the other things. But, um, you know, that, that's just sort of the tip of the iceberg. Um, but Eric was a varsity golfer, a top 10 in PA junior cycling. As youth governor, I think he delivered more than a dozen podium speeches to hundreds in the audience. He gave some keynotes to the lobbyists in the state, the YMCA professionals. He attended week-long conferences three times with governors from around the country and the Conference on North American Affairs. So he's good friends and contacts around the nation. He played ultimate frisbee with a team that went to the semifinals in the region. Twice went to Ohio with us playing water polo. Came back last year with eight wins and one loss there. He was seventh in his class. He uh, went four times to high school stakes. And here's the thing I want to talk about is he's three times the last three summers he worked at Summer Creamers to swim water polo camp. So Eric and his two EPS fellow graduates were the guy who forced at the water polo camp at Camp Pomo this year. They bonded with the kids, fought butterfly and backstroke, played water polo. Almost all of them passed the deep water test. Um, a lot of them ran the Liberty Mile, um, and on the last day of summer school, there were tears in the bodies, me and the kids. And um, we had five summer camps with a matching that you know, summer for myself and for about 25 of our staff. We ran an exercise, um, did an A for Athlete Literacy Project, and the staff, mostly young adults, mostly varsity swimmers, worked that day, made some money, and it made a tremendous impact, I believe, on the lives of the PBS students. These kids are mostly going into fourth grade and learn life skill to never forget about their sports experience. But I think um, it's imperative that PPS put the top of its priority list and vision that we have to play well with others. And this is what we need in our neighborhoods, and this wellness has to spring to life in the afternoons, evenings, nights, weekends, holidays, and summers. The summer dreamers was fine for five weeks, I also worry about the other 47 weeks. Um, there needs to be some quality interactions. And those things with our kids, like Eric, are going to help a great deal. So if we can learn to play well with others, it's a learning skill, happens year-round, beyond the school day, I think PPS will be on its way to making it home. Thank you. Thank you so much.